Good morning everyone. If you have not already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, ring the little bell videos every Tuesday and Friday and the odd occasion we do the Sunday video at half two. Okay, so in today's video, what we're doing is, oh yes, we are silaging the 40 acres I've been talking about and the shed that I've cleaned out. We are not using now, we are using the other shed, little things going on. What we're gonna do is, we're gonna go chopping. Ah! We're gonna go chopping over the road. It is half five, the weather is good. Everyone's going because there's a break in the weather. Please say I didn't just crush my drone. Got the door. We are chopping our 40 acres. It is one hell of a crop like I was been speaking about. Um, should have gone a bit a while ago. Um, my, that's someone taking the mic out of me. We should have gone a while ago. But the weather has been rubbish. It's been raining, 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 and now it is not raining. So we are going to go. I'm going to put this down. I'm going to hitch up to the trailer, and we are going to see you, bed. And we are going to chop some grass. And my cousin's coming to drive, so I can drive the drone. He's a bit bored, so on a Friday night, so he thought he'd give me a hand. So we're going to meet the guy who drive, who owns this tractor, and we're going to have a bit of a chat with him whilst we're doing sick drone shots, sick video. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. I'm going to stop the beeping. I'm going to crack on. See you. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you that future, that future, that future, that future. <laughs> Ceremony. Uh. Let's go. Look around us, there ain't no fences, just bridges to the ears of the listeners. On deck, take a swing, shopping senses, looking for a weakness in the system. Finally, it's you and me, here shaking like a tambourine. We in this finally, both sides of the cemetery. Attention, people, y'all get ready. This is for everybody. We've got the first few loads of storage butt rake and look who's come to drive. So this is my cousin HM Agriculture and Tree Care. I'm gonna jump out here because I'm gonna see this thing. He is coming to drive, we're gonna meet him a little bit more in a bit. But yeah, he's come to help so I can drone, which is amazing. See you in a minute. He was bored, his girlfriend lives in Dubai. So he's like, oh, I'll come drive for you if you want. I was like, all right, cool. So I can do better drone shots, hopefully. I bet that that was good now. So this is the clamp we were at. We didn't video it last year, we just, put it in so I'm videoing it this year we've got Sanderson in the big shovel our normal contractor he's got three people in front of him 
So he's got a really busy, it's gonna rain on Sunday, today's Friday. Tommy Rigby, who's come before, he broke down and he had three people. So these guys fit us in. We're only doing 40 acres, so it's not the biggest amount in the world, but again, this crop is massive. You can see last year where we got up to, you can see on the mark there and the mark here, but there was about a bay of silo, a normal bay of silo already here. So we're probably gonna get that mark again maybe. We might put second crop from this into here because we've got loads of big bales. I wanna get out of the way of him. Big John Deere. Big John Deere tractors, huge trailers, loving it. Look, father's here as well. The whole gang is here today. Hopefully you can hear me because it's very loud in here. Very, very loud. The grass is coming out, grass is coming out. Here. I'll get out of this chap's way. Big kit everywhere, JCB shovel, massive. Big. on with these two fields they have a new chopper and an 18 plate shovel that shovel is unbelievable like i've been saying and the chopper seems to be eating it quite well i thought it'd be slower than it is but this is coming in fast this is my cousin that we finally met i think you've been on a video once in like for about two seconds yeah I think it was, it was we were moving some cows about this is a tractor he, he lends me this is the guy lends it like i say his instagram is hm tree care HMA Tree Care. H and HMA Tree Care. So go, go give him a follow. He's got a big old truck as well with all the gear that's coming out of his ears. We are in his massive 6480. 6480 Dyna chip. Horsepower? Uh, 185. 185 because it's got a big old chip on it, isn't it. That's it. Yeah. See, I know about tractors. I'm just on it. He obviously offered to drive, so it makes my life easier. It's coming in quite nice. Before it was mowing, it was really stalky. I did do a video before. I don't know if I did get it on the start of this video or not. When Tom was mowing, it was really too stalky, and it was bigger than we thought. We wanted it. We wanted to mow two weeks ago, but obviously the rain was awful, and it just didn't really work out. And I don't think it's ever come in this fast before they've got someone else to chop after this and it is seven o'clock so they're probably wanting to start them i think they've got about 80 acres there as well so they'll probably try and do 20 this morning i think you've got to watch the roof in this building you can't just drive out i guess that's one downfall of having a roof on a yeah, clamp isn't it definitely but when you sheet up it's always dry yeah you're not fine with the wind not fine with the wind that's a big <laughs> one that was, that was a great sheet up this year me and dad trying to put it up well we actually so we tried to put it up on the thursday and then uh, it was too windy there's only three of us so we we're waiting for my brother-in-law to come to give us an answer four and it was still as anything about half six in the morning so me and dad got it on ourselves and then we put it on later on which was easy enough no one likes sheeting up especially in the rain that's why we like the inside clamp but again that's a bit of a pain you can't get the tires around you'll see look here maybe i might see it that i've left the tires so i can just chuck them on later on that's the aim anyway i'm gonna stop blabbering on and get some more sick drone shots boom
starting to think there's something wrong with me And you got the only remedy Oh, what I gotta do to make you Give a little love to me Cause it got me tangled up Yeah, I could never get enough Oh, what I gotta do Not all heroes wear capes. Not all heroes wear capes. Donate to my Just Giving page. Yes, donate to my Just Giving page. Three weeks, Charlie, three weeks to go. See ya. All oh, these cheesy curls, so quavers. This is like a cheap version. Yeah. Quavers. Oh. Thank you, Benny. Donate to our Get Just Giving page. Do the right thing. No wonder the 12 grams a packet. The my nephew's friggin' uh, packets of crisps. We <laughs> nailed it. Three packets gone. I'm grateful, but I, I can do about 12 packets of these. <laughs> Sorry. I'm spending money like I just got paid. Hundred dollar bills, tell them keep the change. Come on. Bottle about to make it rain. Let me give you something now to celebrate. Come on. Mm -hmm. And if you're wondering why I move the way I do, I just feel so good. like a superstar yeah, come on and if you're wondering why I move the way I do I just feel so good Dance along, dance along, dance along, yeah. yeah. If you feel it, just dance along. Got to keep the feeling going on and on. Yeah, if you feel it, just dance along, dance along. Oh, I just feel so good. Shovel smashing it, we'll have a bit of a chat with Dad. You can see we've got more silage than we did last year and we had some in from the year before, the farm before. So we've got shed loads of grub in here. I think we might even put second cut in here, yeah, and not do big bales, because we've still got about 
150 big bales. Well, it's kind of fluffy, nice and dry. Have a chat with father, see what he thinks. He's here, look at him. He's here. What? One minute. What? Oh, no. I got it. Father, what do you think of the crop? Good crop, nice stuff, good dry matter. Me, this will be high dry matter. Compacting well, uh, constant rolling while he was filling. Good man on the book rake again. Made a hell of a difference, little and often. Yeah, well, thank you. Yeah, I think we've uh, done well tonight. Just a bit of smashed this 40 acre off for four hours. And it was a big crop in four hours. A big crop. They smashed it there. Uh, that shovel's a bit of kit, isn't it? It does a piece of kit. Heavy. Well, heavy and like the deal. The dry matter's there, so they weren't that heavy load. They weren't 10, 12 tonne of stuff. They might only be five tonne, six tonne in the trailer. But uh, high dry matter, 40%, 50% dry matter. The proof of the pudding will be when we test it. It will, yeah. So it's a nice looking clamp. It's really tidy, solid on top. And yeah, I'm pleased with it. In this video, I have actually not done a lot of work. So my cousin, who has the Massey, he drove most of the time. I say most of the time, I drove it to the end of our drive and he's driven the whole time. So a big shout out to him. Again, if you could follow his Instagram, I'd really appreciate it. HMA Agriculture. It'd be great because he does lend me that tractor a lot and it's a big help for us. And it's great. So big thanks to them. Sanderson's obviously, I've never done a promotion as much as this. We've got Sanderson's all over the trailers and uh, hopefully we've got some really good shots. Well, it helps us out because our regular contractor's so busy catching up after the bad weather. And uh, Bill Sanderson, I've known him for many years, he's a great fella, and if he can, he'll help us out. He's a proper farmer, farmer come contractor. He just gets on with it. And uh, they'll keep going all night if they have to. They're, they're a good set of lads. And uh, they've done us a good job today. A real good job. Mike David does. They're rolling, they're rolling after. I'm gonna get off, what's the noise? Like David does, they're rolling. They're rolling the clamp for us as they get on. He said normally they don't have someone who rolls the clamp for them. My cousin does some butt raking for another contractor and he says he normally just sits on it and just rolls himself. So, you know, it helps when they roll with dad and it's gonna be some good stuff for some heifers, hopefully. Like I say, we don't know if we're gonna put second cut on there. If not, who knows? Guys, if you are getting bored of some silage videos, let me know. If you're still excited, let me know. Put it in the comment section so I know for videos in the future. Really appreciate it, it makes my life easier. Look at these two bits of kit. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. They help, they help me push along, they help grow the channel. So I really appreciate it when you do that. It's amazing. If you want some TV merch, get it at pemtusfarmshop.co.uk slash TV merch, pick it up there. What an afternoon, club day tomorrow. This is probably not gonna come out for a while, but amazing. It's in, done, before the rain on Sunday. So we fit it in, that is what we want. And we will see you in the next one. See you in a bit.